Rocky Four, Zulu Golf, India. The name is Mike, and I'm in Northeast Alabama. Over. Roger, Mike in Alabama. And what radio are you running, sir? Roger, Mike in Alabama. And what radio are you running, sir? I am running a Tentec Jupiter uh, with a column 30L1 behind it. Over. Roger, Roger. Okay, Mike, um, why don't you give me about 10 seconds on your antenna system and uh, let me hear your audio. Give me about 10 seconds on your antenna system and uh, let me hear your audio. Okay, very good. Uh, my antenna system AM dipole up about 50 feet. Uh, kind of in up about 50 feet. Uh, kind of in an inverted B arrangement. And this is the uh, newer Tentac uh, Jupiter. It's the black cabinet with the blue screen, which is just a newer version. And uh, now, and I've got my peak processor set at 20%. Uh, over. Roger. Roger, uh, maybe about another 10% on that uh, compressor. We want about... Uh, a three out of ten. Uh, a three if it's uh, zero to uh, ten. A three, and if it's uh, zero to a hundred, uh, thirty. So just about a third of it, uh, rather than twenty. Roger. But but uh, you know your your ballpark, but just just a skosh more. Ballpark, but just just a score. Okay, there. I've got it up to thirty uh, percent right now. Um, did that make any difference? Over. Well, it's a, st it's a starting point. Uh, now uh, we'd like to go to your AOC with the uh, mic gain in hand. And as you speak fairly rapidly, 100, 200, 300, so you can see what your AOC meter is doing, uh, we want you to adjust the uh, output, uh, I mean the uh, level of the AOC to where it reads mid scale to two thirds. Mid scale to two thirds on your AOC meter by way of mic gain manipulation. Mid scale to two thirds on your AOC meter by way of mic gain manipulation. Yeah, Roger. The, um, unfortunately, this radio does not have an AOC meter. It's got a little AOC light that blinks on voice peaks, and it's uh, blinking pretty steadily right now. Uh, it's um, not staying lit full time, but it is blinking on and off, so I know I've got at least enough mic gain, but I've got the mic gain cut way back on this uh, because I think I have quite a bit of mic gain with the microphone element itself over Roger. Well, you know, the mic, the actual mic gain is not important. It's uh, how the mic gain affects your ALC. So uh, where you have it set now, or did have it set, it looks good to me. Uh, we're running about uh, 3 dB dynamic range, which is where you want to be. So I would say uh, you've got that mic set to, uh, right on target, Roger. Say so, uh, you've got that mic set to, uh, right on target, Roger. Very good. I appreciate your help very much. Um, there's not an awful lot of things you can do. There's, uh, I think there's some kind of, there's a, um, a transmit bandwidth. Uh, I think I've got it set as normal. Um, but I surely appreciate your help, and uh, I know the band conditions are horrible this afternoon, and it's a tough time. So I appreciate you. Thank you very much. Yes, sir. I just went down to uh, Arlington SDR. I've got a much better copy on you uh, there. Uh, and it's weird because you're in Alabama. I don't know why uh, Arlington would be much better than Milford. But anyway, uh, I do have a better copy on you. So if you would like to give me uh, 10, 15 seconds about uh, something you really like about your radio, uh, we can get a, a little bit better recording. Roger? About your radio, uh, we can get a, a little bit better recording. Roger? Hi, oh, Roger. Very good. I will. Um, I'm a, kind of a Tentec person to start with, but um, I, I've had several Jupiters, and I, I think they have a wonderful receiver and an ICOM 7600 that I like a lot. But uh, the old uh, the old Jupiters are pretty good old radios. They don't have a lot of the newer bells and whistles, but they've got an awful lot of good stuff in them um, anyway. So how was that? Over. 
Yes, sir. I finally went to my local antenna, and I got pretty good copy on you there. I usually have a lot better frequency response from my local radio than uh, the SDRs. SDRs uh, tend to roll off uh, at about 250 cycles or so, so uh, my local receiver is good down to 100. Uh, I was going to ask you, oh, does that radio happen to have EQ on it or no? No, it really does not have EQ. Um, no, it does not. All right. I would suggest that you back off the mic about uh, uh, two inches from where you're, where you're working it now. See if we can get a little bit more top end uh, versus bottom end. You know, the proximity effect is you approach the closeness to a microphone, the ba you have a bass buildup. So I want to hear you about uh, two inches uh, further back off that mic uh, than where you have been working it. Roger? Roger, very good. That's where I'm at now. I went back about two or three inches, and uh, it's uh, still, uh, uh, my ALC isn't quite blinking as uh, steadily as it was, but it's still up there and good. Uh, did that change anything? Over. I'm starting to uh, hear just a little bit of room noise, so let's uh, compromise about halfway between, <laughs> we're nitpicking here, but about halfway between where you were just now and where you were earlier. About half that distance, Roger. Roger, very good. That's where I'm at right now, about halfway in. Um, I, I hope that's, uh, it's, uh, it's a pretty sensitive microphone, over. Yes, sir. Uh, and uh, so your ALC is running uh, still mid-scale to two-thirds, Roger? Well, it's, you know, it's blinking, the light is blinking. I wish I, <laughs> I, wish I had a meter that would read the uh, percentage of ALC, but it does not do that on this radio. Roger. Well, it's reading the uh, the right place. It's uh, it's reflecting uh, a, a a message at the correct place. So just uh, so that's fairly flashing regularly. You know, uh, you'll be uh, in good shape uh, audio wise uh, at uh, 3 dB. Roger. Roger. Very good. I sure appreciate your help a lot, and uh, I know the band uh, is not very good today. Over. Well, it's uh, better than it was last Friday. We had, you know, did not have uh, good conditions at all last Friday. So uh, uh, we're thankful that uh, Mother Nature has uh, decided to uh, bestow a little better propagation uh, this Friday. Roger. Roger, Roger. Uh, well, you have a good day, and we appreciate it very much. Thank you. W4ZGI, Mike. Roger, Roger, Mike 73, sir. You have a great afternoon, beautiful weekend. And if you want to hear your audio, if you go to YouTube and do a call letter search for KC9VKV, along with today's date, 72321, that will take you to this recording and give us a couple of days to get it uploaded. Roger, Roger. Thank you, Mike. Roger, Mike, 73, sir. This is KC9 VKV, the Friday afternoon QSO VLOG net. If you have a radio you want to check out, give me a shout.